Hello everyone, thanks for checking out my video. Today I'm going to show you how to use Awesome Miner and Mining Pool Hub to mine Ethereum Classic. The first step is to grab a copy of Awesome Miner. I'll leave a link in the description. Come over here and click on the top link, Awesome Miner Installer. That's the full program. Download that and install it. The next step is to set up an account at miningpoolhub.com. If it's your first time signing up, make sure you choose a username that's easy to remember because you will be typing it in later on. The third step is to come over to the Ethereum Classic website and download a desktop wallet to store your Ethereum Classic. They have several different choices here, so just go ahead and choose whichever best suits your needs. Now it's time to start configuring Awesome Miner. When you first install the program, it usually presents you with a bunch of different wizards and pop-ups. Just go ahead and cancel through all of those. I'll take you through step by step. When you get to this main window here, the first thing we need to do is add a new miner. So we just go up here on the top left and click the new miner button. That'll give us the add new miner wizard. We can go ahead and click on next. And there are a few options here. What we want to use is called managed profit miner. So highlight this and then click on next. From here, I can go ahead and give my miner a name. I'm going to call mine Big Red. The miner host is local. And then for your profit switching profile, be sure to choose whichever one matches your graphics card. So in my case, I have an NVIDIA GPU, so I'll just go ahead and click on that. What this does is it makes sure that the mining software that's used is tailored for your equipment. Once that's chosen, go ahead and click on Next, and we'll confirm it. Everything looks good. Click on Finish. And here's our new miner. The next step is to add Ethereum Classic to our list of coins that we can mine. To do that, we need to add a new pool. So we'll just go ahead and click on the new pool button right here. That'll give us the add new pool dialog. And we're going to go ahead and type in Ethereum Classic. I'm going to put MPH there so I know that this is for mining pool hub. Now we need the server URL. What I'm going to do here is type in stratum plus TCP colon forward slash forward slash and now we'll need the address and port number so to get that we go over here to miningpoolhub.com from the main page all of the coin pools are listed underneath the pools section on the left hand side and right here it says ethereum classic if we click on this this news page here pretty much gives us all the information that we need it tells us the port number here and it gives us the server addresses here. So depending on what region you're in, you're basically going to select this entire address, right click, copy, go back over here to Awesome Miner and paste that in, and then put a colon, and we have to add the port number. Now, in my experience, I haven't been able to actually use the standard port number. I actually have to use a little bit different one that they use for proxy but it works just as well. That proxy port number is 20556. Now all it's left to do is to configure our worker name and password. So the worker name is the username that you chose at miningpoolhub.com. So in my case, that's Goose Tech. Keep in mind, this is case sensitive. Then add a dot and provide a worker name. So since this, this is my GTX 1080, I'm just gonna call it 1080. That way, when I look on the stats page, or the workers page on Mining Pool Hub, I'll know this is my 1080 that's doing the work. Underneath password, you can make that an X. And then down here where it says optional settings, you can go ahead and set your coin to Ethereum Classic, which is right here underneath the Ethereum section. Go ahead and click on OK, because now our pool is set. Next, we're going to tell Awesome Miner which coin to mine. So just go up here and click on Options. Go to Profit Switching. And then right here at the top, make sure that you have a check in the box for Enabled Managed Profit Switching. Make sure that you turn off all of these other addresses. Make sure you put a check mark here where it says Custom Pools. And then click the down arrow and go to Ethereum Classic, this one up top. That's the one that we just made, okay? And click on the OK button. Now all that's left to do is to tell Mining Pool Hub where to send the Ethereum Classic. So we'll go back over here to Mining Pool Hub. Underneath my account, there's a link here for wallet. Click on that. 
and this is your online wallet. So all of the Ethereum Classic that you mine will appear right here where it says normal wallet. But it's not really that secure to save all of your Ethereum Classic online. It's best to actually have it transferred to your desktop wallet. So what you would do is, depending on which desktop wallet you have chosen to use, grab the receive address, copy it, and paste it right here at the top where it says payment address. And then on the next line here, it says automatic payout threshold. Well, you can set this with a minimum of 0.01 Ethereum Classic or up from there, um, wherever you need it to be. So you pick a number that's good for you, put in your four digit pin code or your OTP code, uh, which is your Google authenticator code, and then click on update account. That will save your receive address and once the payout threshold is reached, it will automatically transfer any of the Ethereum Classic that's been mined over to your desktop wallet. Now, we're pretty much ready to start mining. So all you have to do is go ahead and click on the start button. As you can see, it's already starting to mine. The information is being reported here. Well, that's pretty much it for me, guys. I hope you found this video helpful. If so, please give me a thumbs up and be sure to hit subscribe and ding the bell so that you get future updates. If you'd like to continue the conversation, come join us over on our Discord server. I'll leave a link down below and you can meet other like-minded individuals, get mining tips, and talk crypto. Thanks again for watching, guys. God bless.